Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, we have got this rectangle A, B, C, D, as you can see in this figure, whose length is 10 and width is 6. And this rectangle consists of two purple triangles as well as two green triangles. And now we are going to calculate the area of these two purple triangle. This one and this one combined. And now just keep in your mind that we are going to calculate the purple shaded region. That is same as finding the combined area of these two purple triangles. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. And here's our very first step. Let's go ahead and divide this rectangle ABCD into four quadrants as you can see in this new diagram. And we can see that this point O is behaving like the origin over here at this point. And now let me go ahead and call this rectangle. I'm going to call this uh, quadrant one this rectangle i'm going to call this quadrant two this quadrant i am going to call three and finally this quadrant i am going to call four and now let's do one observation in each quadrant or rectangle purple triangle is congruent to green triangle according to angle side angle postulate and now let's focus on this third quadrant for example this one we can see that these green and purple triangles share this common side and this angle is 90 degrees and this angle is 90 degree as well this angle is same as this angle because they are alternate angle and moreover this angle is same as this angle because they are alternate angles as well so thus we conclude that the area of the purple shaded region is equal to the area of the green shaded region so therefore we conclude that the area of this purple shaded region is equal to the half of the area of this whole rectangle ABCD. And here's the area of a rectangle formula. Area equals to length time width. In our case, the length of this rectangle is 10 and the width is 6. So let's go ahead and calculate it. So 1 over 2 times the area of the rectangle is going to be simply 10 times 6. So when we simplify everything, so 60 divided by 2 means that turns out to be 30 square units. So thus the area of these two purple triangles turns out to be 30 square units. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.